Can you talk Thank about you. a little? Um, yeah, you know, I played very good the last two days, actually. Um, hit a lot of good shots, had a lot of opportunities. The greens are perfect, and today I made three more than I did yesterday. Um, so, two good rounds, and uh, it's nice because I haven't particularly played well here in the pre my pre two previous showings, so nice to play well this year. What's going better this time around? What have you figured out? Nothing. Um, I'm just playing better. You know, um, I had last week off. I didn't hit any. Go I didn't play any golf. Didn't hit any shots. I just I was doing the Fox coverage for TV for the U.S. Open, so I didn't even have my clubs with me. And I flew home from there and didn't even fly up here till Wednesday. So I had a nice week and a half off from playing any golf. Although I was immersed in maybe the biggest championship going on in the world. So. Um, learned a lot from those guys just watching, you know, Brooks Kepka I had him on Sunday and how they go about it. And I think I was getting a little too worked up, uh, putting a little pressure on myself playing. And he looks like he's not trying and he's <laughs> winning majors. So um, I just kind of took a little bit of that and said, you know, let's just play golf. You've done this your whole life. And two days it's been working out well. Is it easy to take the foot off the gas? You know, for as long no, as you've that, done it. that's the thing. You know, it's <clears throat> from years past. I've never particularly made a whole lot of birdies here, and you have to make putts, and you have to keep your foot on the gas. And and on this tour, um, since it's only three rounds, it's kind of a, it's not so much a shootout, but you have to just be aggressive. And um, you know, that's never been kind of my mo in my 20 years playing the tour. I'm kind of a plotter and conservative, and not a big risk taker. And out here, I've had to change that. And, some of my screw-ups are because I haven't been very comfortable playing like that. So um, I'm not even saying I played aggressively the first two days. I just kind of played the way I normally play. But um, a few more putts went in today, and, um, you know, I played a, played a nice round. If you every group that comes in, there's a new leader. Yeah, that's, that's kind of the MO here. Um, and probably why I haven't particularly played well in the past. I don't think I put it particularly well. And, and today I made, uh, you know, some – some 15 20 footers and um, not all days will those go in you know those are hard to make you know it's usually days you shoot you know seven eight under you're making some you know a lot of five and six footers but today I made some nice long ones especially on the par fives which have been a little bit of a problem for me this year so you know it's one of those days I played well and I'm looking forward to playing tomorrow it's like watching the Kepkas of the world gave you like a different mentality like you can go out and have fun a little more now well, you know, I have, I've, I've been having fun. Um, I just haven't been shooting low scores. You know, I've been shooting two, three under, you know, just, and out here that's kind of par each day. And, and today a couple of nice putts went in, but it's a, I hate the word patience because in no way, shape or form am I great at it, but that's kind of how you have to play this game. And that's what Brooks, Brooks literally watched, I watched him for three days last year, last week out of four. And he literally looks like it's, I play good or bad, it's, it is what it is, and that's, you know, it was fun to watch, so I'm glad I'm playing against guys my own age and not guys their age, I can tell you that. If you get grouped with Stricker or Kelly, they're both, you know, threatening down the stretch here, what would that be like tomorrow, and do you like playing in front of, you know, I, I may not get as big a crowd as you would be if they, if they happen to be in the last group. Well, I would imagine I probably wouldn't be the guy everybody's rooting for in the group, which is fine, but... Uh, um, they're easy guys to play with, very encouraging. They compliment good shots. So, um, yeah, it's, it's fine if I, get, if I play with them here. At least there'll be a lot of people out there. There'll be a lot of nice energy in the day. And how many events do you do for Fox? Is it just the Open? I just do the Open. I used to do five uh, okay. before I turned 50, and now my boss at Fox, my executive producer, Mark Loomis, is nice enough to let me do just the U.S. Open. So everything else conflicts. The Women's Open, the U.S. Amateur, our senior open I'm playing next week, so everything else conflicts with a tournament on our tour. So he's nice enough to, one, let me keep my job, and two, allow me to only do it one week a year. Nice.